birthday. Actress Amanda Seyfried reckons she's finally learned to stop exercising and dieting to excess. The 24-year-old Mamma Mia star said, I used to live, eat and sleep by an exercise schedule and I just couldn't enjoy myself if I didn't exercise. Luckily, she's realized that moderation is the key and now she only runs for about half an hour, five days a week and just does Pilates on the weekend. Not only that, she sees a personal trainer. So, not exactly moderate, um, but how easy do you find it to moderate yourself? And what sort of things would you say that you do to excess? Uh, well... <laughs> <laughs> See, look... <laughs> Now. No, look, uh, look. It's a, it's an absolute um, misconception, isn't it? That misperception that pe people think I drink all the time. I don't, <laughs> and I really don't. I am, I'm not a moderate drinker when I drink, and so I do drink to excess usually when I have a drink. But it's not all the time. So but you even do drink to drink excess, though. Yeah, ex excess in the sense that you know I can't it's cope. Too many. With it. Well, more than I can cope yes. with. Yes. yes. <laughs> no, I don't to stop no but um <laughs> I, I do stop before most people but well, no, that you way, stop so when stop. you fall off the stool that's when you stop <laughs> anyway apart from you know having a few too many glasses yes. of wine of a weekend um no apart from that i'm quite good are you and i did i used to exercise to excess i was totally addicted to yeah. exercise and i did it for like three or four hours a day you know i i didn't actually look like madonna but i exercised like madonna um and I stopped all of that, and food, everything. I've, I've been excessive about a lot of things, but I've, I've learned through my life to, to curb those excesses. What, and about, I, and what I'm, about holidays? I'm quite good now. Yes, but... Yes, but... Yeah, OK, I have a lot of holidays. Yeah. What about... But it's um, not to excess. What about jeans? <laughs> Jeans? Yes, you have hundreds of jeans. No, I don't. Jackets, boots, I don't. shoes. I have, no, I have 20 pairs of jeans. Oh, sorry. <laughs> That's not a lot. Is it? No, it's not. It's not excessive. I see that all the things like holidays and clothes and things like that that I might buy a lot of, but not to the point of excess, I buy because I don't have children, I don't mm. have a big mortgage, and I don't take drugs. So I've got to spend my money on something. <laughs> But also it begs oh, yeah. the question, what is one person's excess is another person's yeah. normality? It's so true. as long as it's not getting you into trouble, is it really excessive? Well, I think that my partner would say that I work to excess. You know, I don't think I do. Mm -hmm. um, but I do Have do some ever? odd things. I don't know. I mean, if you enjoy something, is it excessive? You know, do I do more than I should or need to? Possibly. But I, I do... Uh, the things that I am excessive at are watching television, working on the computer and having a magazine or a newspaper on the side. Mm. That's a little bit odd. But the other thing I question is, I have a friend who was advised when she couldn't get pregnant to eat grapes every day. Right. Now, what they meant was, with her diet, she stopped eating anything else and for a month <laughs> all she ate were black grapes and she was in agony her stomach was I'm in not agony surprised. because but her whole life is yeah. based on excess you know when she when she decided to find religion it was ex it was absolutely sure. excessive that is, when is excess turn to obsession or addiction you know, I think some people are addicted. They, their excesses mm. they are addictive. I think if it is causing you, you know, physical pain or, you know, financial problems or anything like that, yeah. then obviously That's it excess. has become or a it's problem. it's damaging other people. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, in terms of, you know, um, you know, you say you, you watch TV and do the computer, and I'm like that. I find it's a waste of saying? time. Yeah. If I'm watching the TV and I know the dishwasher isn't on, or if as soon as I come downstairs, and, or if it's a sunny day, I think it's, it's sunny, I should have washing on the line, otherwise I'm yeah. wasting... And I like to do at least yeah. a few things at the same time. Is, it, is that oddly excessive, do you I think? I don't think so. I think I that's think multitasking that's in a very I mean, sensible manner. It's a bit manner. mad. It's, it is. It's <laughs> slightly, it's slightly <laughs> controlling. Yeah. That's controlling, though. That's, that's controlling. Cool. That's what you, you need to do. I mean, I've got a thing about my lawn. You know, that's excessive. <laughs> well, no, 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 yeah, I, I have to mow my lawn. And I won't let anybody else mow it because it has to be mowed in a certain way. And it has to, the, the, the corners have to be cut. It's a bit like making your bed. You know, when you make your bed, nobody can make your bed like you do, can they? Well, that, yes, I do. I understand the bed thing. Yeah, it's Because when I make the bed, yeah, I do know exactly how I make the bed. If Mark makes it, I'm like, oh, I get, oh no. I'll go and make it again. But, you know, I Mark, you it, Mark make is excessive bed. about oh, things. I do make my bed. I make a bed every day. personalities I think you but have about beds and gardens. No, it's, 
it's not. It's not. It, there is, you know, there, I don't. I don't buy that addictive personality thing. And I think if you can't control your excesses, you know, then you may have a, a, an issue or a problem. But mm. I mean, Mark is Mark is excessive in when he when he eats late at night. We were in a hotel the other weekend. We were in Manchester. And um, I got up in the morning, especially when we've been out, you know, on the town. He gets home, room service. And I got up in the morning, and I was obviously fast asleep. And it looked like there'd been a party in the room. <laughs> and I was like, there's plates everywhere and trays. And I went, oh, no. Who came back last night? I didn't hear a thing. And he said, nobody. And I said, well, what's all, what's all this food and plates and, and knives and forks and glasses? And he said, well, I ordered a club sandwich. I said, that's not a club sandwich. <laughs> he said, no. I ordered four. <laughs> I think you ordered four club sandwiches Amazing. and ate them all. No, no, no but you yes, see, I've got the same all. thing with banoffee pie. I can't walk past. <laughs> no, I am. I can't walk past a banoffee pie. It actually jumps into my mouth. <laughs> and I have to, it, the whole lot jumps that's into my mouth. Not just that, a banana. That's not obsessive. That's just greedy little piggies. Yes, that's what that all. is.